Okay, today I'm going to be seeing how much weight a black beetle can pull. So beetles are pretty strong insects. In fact, the dung beetle has been named the world's strongest insect because it can pull 1,100 times its own body weight. So I'm not sure what species this guy is here. I'm just gonna call it a black beetle. Okay, so this here is my pet black beetle. His name is Norm. He's gonna help me out with my next experiment. So I previously did an experiment with flies where I saw how much a fly could lift. And it could lift around 50 milligrams, which is pretty amazing. So I expect this guy to be able to pull at least more than 50 milligrams because he's not flying with it, he just has to pull it. So let's see what he can do. So there are around 300,000 different species of beetles. In fact, the great biologist Haldane, he was asked about the nature of the creator or God. Haldane is said to have said, God has an inordinate fondness for beetles. <laughs> So with my flies, I put them in the freezer and that slowed down their metabolism enough that I could just, while they laid there, wrap the string around them. But for the beetle, I'm not sure if that will happen, so I'm not gonna risk it. Okay, so I just dabbed on some washable glue. This should come off with water. So you can see that it's already slipping a lot on this plate. So I'm gonna give him a little bit of traction, something that is strong enough for him to dig his feet in, but still allows some good sliding with the balls that I'm gonna be putting attached to him. Okay, let's see how much the ball weighs. So it's a magnet, so I can't put it right on there or else it'll inflate the weight. So I'm just gonna put it on this eraser first and tear it, then put it on. So it weighs around 3.36 grams. Okay, let's attach our first weight to it. Okay, so this ball weighs 3.3 grams. Okay, let's go, beetle. It's doing it. It moved. <laughs> Look at that. Wow, 3.3 grams it's pulling. Wow, look at that. That's amazing. <laughs> Look at it pulling it, <laughs> easily pulling it. Let me add another weight on it. Okay, this should be 6.7 grams. Let's see if he can pull it. Whoa, he's moving it. Look at that. That's awesome. <laughs> so even without me doing anything, it's easily dragging it now. That's awesome. Wow, it's easily dragging them. It's getting better at it now. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, so obviously there's a lot of variability in this because it really depends on how much friction on the surface there is where the weights are placed. You saw that when the beetle was on the plate, it couldn't even carry its own weight up the side of the plate. That's because it couldn't dig into the surface of the plate to get any traction. Okay, now let's see how much the beetle weighs. So it only weighs 0.158 grams. That is crazy. So it was able to drag 42 times its body weight. So that's like a person being able to drag 42 people behind them, or around 6,300 pounds. Okay, so we've had some fun with Norman, our beetle here. He has eaten well, eaten Cheerios and grass for a while, but now it's time to cut him loose and let him go. Okay, now we'll set him free. Okay, go for it, big guy. He's somewhere there, I can't really see him. He should be the strongest beetle on the block now. There it goes. See you, buddy. Hey, thanks for watching another episode of The Action Lab. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it and you haven't subscribed yet, remember to hit the subscribe button and you can leave me any comments or questions that you have in the comments section. I'll try to get to them. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.